Hey guys, thanks for checking out my video and my channel, and welcome back to Grand Union. Guys, today we're doing a quick video because it is Dom's birthday, and I want to make sure that I get up to say happy birthday to him. So let's head up to his place right now, okay? And boy, this weather is not very great, is it? Oh yeah, guys. The Abel Sisters has moved. Check that out. And I did move the river just a little bit. I'm not exactly sure if I like this area here as it looks right now. So I might actually do this over at some point. But so far, oh, look. Lopez is reading. I wonder if that's his book and glasses. All right, guys. So hope everybody is having a great day today. It is Thursday, March 18th. And it is Dom's birthday. So I'm really excited. Let's see who's at his house for the party. And I got him a really cool present. All right, guys, let's see what's going on. Oh my God. Chuck, you made it. Of course I did, Dom. How could I not? Oh my god, this is too funny. So, Dom is a jock villager, obviously, and Tammy is a sisterly villager who also has kind of like, I guess you'd almost say like jock tendencies as well. So I guess it makes sense that the two of them would be together celebrating um, Dom's birthday. That's really cool. All right. Oh my god, look at Dom. He looks awesome. I really appreciate that you, my good friend, stopped by. Of course. And I'll appreciate it even more if you, my good friend, have a present for me, bucko. <laughs> Dom, of course I have a present for you. Appreciate this. Oh yeah, guys. Are you ready to see what I got him? All right. I wonder what it is. Oh, oh wow, did you really? An A Animal Crossing New Horizon Nintendo Switch. Oh yeah, guys, I went all out for my boy Dom. Yeah, Dom, you got yourself an ACNH Nintendo Switch. So you're going to be able to play Animal Crossing yourself. You're so cool, I can't believe you got me such an awesome present. Thanks for the birthday present you made me. Friends for life. Aww. That's awesome. Tammy, what's going on here? Hey there, so you here for Dom's birthday too? That's awesome. I'm pulling out all the stops for him. This birthday is gonna rock. All right, let's get away from that radio because it's like way too loud. Birthdays are such a blast. I don't know how they're gonna top, how they're going to top this next year, but I got ideas. That's awesome. The decorations look awesome and they should. We've been working on it. Feathers off, maple sugar. I just love the special birthday flavor a room gets when it's all snazzy, you know? That's so cool. Alright, Dom, what else is going on? My goal this year is a billion squats. My legs will be so huge, they'll each have their own government. That's awesome. Oh, guys, what is this here? I'm so happy that you came. My smile's getting a serious workout today. Guys, what's this topiary right here to the right of me? I don't think I've ever seen this before. Is that one of the new ones that's coming out? For Animal Crossing? Or is this something that's been in the game right along? Because this house looks a little bit different, obviously, with the banners and the cake and everything. Alright, let's see what else he has to say. All this attention makes me feel like a superhero. Thank you, thank you. No time for autographs, folks. Gotta go suplex a volcano, bucko. Oh my god, Dom, you're the best. This is so cool. Chuck heading out already, bucko? Well, thanks for stopping by today, and thanks for the gift. Dom, you are welcome. Absolutely. 
All right, guys, let's see what we got going on here. It's raining out. Who's this back here? Oh, it's Dizzy. What's going on, Dizzy? I always dig running into you, Chuck. How's things? What's the latest? Rainy day like this are perfect for playing games indoors. Me, I really like to play run around and scream. My god, Dizzy. Is something up? I haven't been paying attention. Let's talk. It's Mary's last day here? That makes me sad, man. What? You know, maybe that's gonna be my superhero name now, Sad Man. Mary's leaving? What? I just moved her house. What is going on right now? Guys, I just got our house all situated here, and I finally put the pink flowers back in to kind of go with her pink mauve colored roof line. Guys, could she really be leaving? All right, let's go in and find out. Oh my god, guys! Mary's leaving. Oh. I know we talked the other day, but I wasn't sure you were actually gonna go. Hey, Superstar, thanks for all your advice. I've decided to move out. And I'm like, low-key worried that everyone's going to suffer from Mary's... Mary deficiency. Ah, uh, yeah, Mary, we are. But they've got you, don't they, Superstar? You'll take good care of everyone. Oh, guys. So she came to me the other day, um, actually right after I did my video. And she was talking about moving. But I wasn't sure that she was going to go, because we continued talking like after... I don't know, guys. And so I set out in search of new lands, adventures, and maybe love. I bet we'll see each other again. It's a big world, but there's so much of it, right? Wow, guys. Mary's leaving. So I think I have her amiibo card. I guess this will be good. We can, we can do another villager hunt um, coming up. Actually, I guess I'll have to do it either tomorrow or Monday. No, what's today? Thursday? So Friday or Saturday. Oh, God, guys. Oh, man. So... I won't feel bad because uh, Mary's not in her actual home. She's in the starter home, which was one of those houses that I had to build, like, you know, all the stuff for outside and build stuff for inside. And I had found her on the Mystery Island um, back when, like, it was just my, um, it was Paula and Sheldon. They were my first two villagers that started with me. They came off the plane with me. And then I met Dizzy and then I met Mary. And I had invited both of them to the island. So, wow, guys, Dizzy is going to be my last villager um, from my original my original crew. Wow. All right. I wonder what kind of friends I'll make on the new island. I'm so excited. Oh, Mary, as long as you're happy. Well, guys, Mary's excited to go. All right. Bye, Mary.
Wow, guys. All right. So that's it for Mary. She is out of here. There's Daisy. Hi, Daisy. Vitamin C, hey, nice to see you. Let's chat. You just got to make time to read a history of resident services. I need to talk about it with someone. What's up, sugar cakes? This is for you. You want to give me something? I do. I am going to give you, oh, I bet this, it's orange. It's an orange bag, guys, orange present. But there's going to be some pumpkins in there. I wonder what's inside. Mm, I bet it's going to be some pumpkins. Some green pumpkins? How nice. Thank you. Now, how to use this gift? I'll have to give it some good thought, sugar cakes. As a thank you, please take my daisy photo. What? Oh, oh my god, guys! Daisy's giving me her photo! What? Oh my god, guys! This is like... Oh my god, this is like all... this. This episode's like all over the place, guys. I was not expecting to get her photograph at all. All right. Hang on. Let's set it down so you can see it. Place the item. All right. Guys, all right, let's see if I can remember to do this correctly. Boom, there we go. There I am with Daisy's photo. Oh my god, guys, I got Daisy's photo. That's amazing. So, for those of you that aren't playing the game, or all right, hang on, let me get out of this. So, for those of you that aren't playing the game or not familiar, so as you give um, your villagers gifts, which those of you that know, I've been giving all my villagers pumpkins. As you continue to give them those gifts, um, it builds points. So you're kind of on a point system, and they'll start wanting to, you know, change nicknames with you and, and exchange things and have you buy things from them and so on and so forth. Well, eventually, as you give them gifts, they will eventually give you their villager photo. And that's like the highest tier thing. So, like, Daisy and I are pretty much best friends. Look at her, she's singing, guys. And guys, look. We got our um, anniversary, um, Animal Crossing New Horizon anniversary cake today in the rain. But I had to put it out on display. So it's on a piano bench table. And um, so it looks actually really good. All right, hang on. Get out of the way here. So there it is. Not bad, huh? Oh, wow. All right, so we got to see Dom's birthday today. Daisy gave me her photo. But sadly, Mary's leaving. All right, let's see what LaBelle label wants. Oh, hello there. I'm here on Grand Union to study design some more. If it isn't not an imposition, would you mind doing another style session with me? Try putting together an outfit that's super comfy. You know, something you'd wear if you were lounging around the house or, say, relaxing in front of the TV. I'll give you some comfy clothing so you have an idea of the look I'm going for. Okay. You see, it's a humble sweater. Now try to put together an entire outfit with comfy written all over it. If that sounds too hard, just wear something... Some items that look like you'd go nicely with what I gave you. I'll be waiting right here, okay? All right. So let's see what the sweater looks like. Uh, yeah, no. Oh, I thought I could hear a balloon, guys. Uh-oh. Alright, hang on guys. The yellow balloons are always good. 
they are oftentimes the bell balloons, I call them. So let's see. Are they, are they going to be bells, guys? Or are they going to be a DIY? What do you think? Let's see. Ooh, 5,000 bells. Ooh, all right. Let's put that away. Nice. All right. So let's go into the house. And yes, guys, I will eventually have my house somewhere permanent on the island. Just not sure yet where it's going to go. Uh, let's see. Go to the wardrobe. And we've got to figure out something comfy. All right, so let's get changed. All right, let's see. Something comfy. Well, probably a tank top. And if I'm at home, probably would be a pair of shorts. some sneakers. Probably some flip-flops. What am I wearing on my feet anyways? Oh, I have socks on. All right. Um, hmm. I don't know, guys. No. Uh, hmm. Well, that's interesting. I don't have, um... Oh, guys. Hello. PJ outfit for sure. Come on. All right, and let's wear. Yeah, there we go. That looks pretty comfy, doesn't it? Sure, it does. All right. Let's see. Bunny ears. Guys, Easter's coming pretty soon. Alright, let's not let's not do the bunny ears yet. Sure, there we go. That works for me. Whoops. There we go. Because obviously, if I'm going to be in my comfy clothes at home, I'm not doing my hair, guys, just so you know. So I'm going to be a big old hot mess. All right. Ah, it looks like you've changed clothes. Might I see that outfit? Of course you may. Oh, good. Let's see it then. Ah, uh, hmm. I see. Don't be judging me like that. Wonderful. That's it exactly. Of course it is. You told me to be comfy. PJs, obviously. Right, guys? Your combination of clothing radiates that perfect, comfy look. I'm getting, like, soaking wet out here. This is ridiculous. There's just so much I can learn from your sense of style. Thank you. I'm going to send a little gift to you home to show my appreciation. Just don't forget that tailor tickets are supposed to be used at the tailor shop. Okay? I want you to have this too. It's one of my own creations. Some LaBelle socks. You see, it's a piece from my very own label. It is a new design. I just finished it, in fact, and it's going to be sold at the tailor shop. Well, thank you so much. I hope you'll consider helping me again in the future. So guys, one thing I have to say, I actually, 
I have some of the Taylor um, tickets and I used them all up on a couple different outfits that I bought, but I had one left and I was really excited because I was actually able to purchase the St. Patrick's Day outfit and I got it for free, which was really awesome. I mean, it was only 3,000 bells, but still, to be able to get that for free, it was pretty cool. Oh, guys, look at this. Pietro and Lopez are waving at each other. All right, Pietro, what's happening? Oh, hang on, guys. Scaring Pietro away. Pietro, what's going on, man? Chow maple sugar. Let's chat. I'm just out enjoying the cool breezes of Grand Union. All right, you got my attention. What's up, Maple Sugar? Let's talk. I heard through the cherry vine that you're, you've are you been excavating a ton of fossils lately, Maple Sugar. Yeah, guys, I have been actually digging up a lot of fossils. I always wa wonder what kind of designer clothes those ancient creatures like to wear. Oh, Pietro. All right, let's see what Lopez has to say. Clean, fresh, and good. Well, you know, I've always heard that clean, fresh, and good makes a grand union, so I guess that makes sense. I want to chat. I was just wondering if I'd run into you. I guess that means I was thinking about you. Lucky me. Looking for a rap session with old Lopez? Let's chat. Tomorrow's the big day, I suppose. Mary will leave our little island paradise first thing. I'll be seeing her off today with a smile and a spin, as if my custom you, sh you should say goodbye to. Actually, I already went over and talked to her, Lopez. Anything else? Hey, what you up to, bucko? I want to chat. Going back to the basics with your PJ outfit? Well, no, this is actually a project that um, Label asked me to uh, do for her. So, that's why I'm out here in the rain and my jammies and my uh, knit hat. I approve. Not that you need my approval, but maybe I need yours. Do you approve of my approval? <sighs> Lopez. Well, you know, the good thing is, guys, Pietro and Lopez are both smug characters, and they both totally had different dialogue today, which was awesome. <gasps> guys. Kurt and Daisy are talking. Let's find out what's going on. Check this out, Luck. Lucky? Did you just call me Lucky? Kurt's calling me Lucky, guys. What is going on right now? Check this out, Lucky. It's better than honey butter. Daisy wrote a song about cherries. Oh, that's our native island fruit, so that's kind of cool. Okay, here goes. Since I came to Grand Union, I've had so many cherries. As I said, it's our native fruit. They're so cherry good. Just give them a try. Cherries are great in cakes or in pies. So many cherries up in our trees. Yummy sweet cherries for you and for me. Wasn't that fun? I really like the part where she sings about the cherries. Oh my goodness gracious. So, what do you think? It was really fun. It was alright. I'm not really sure. No, we don't want to hurt her feelings, guys. She just gave me her photo, for God's sakes. Come on. She just gave me her photo. We're best friends. Sometimes you just kind of got to realize that everybody marches to their own drum. You know what I mean? So, all right. It was actually really fun. I mean, I've never heard my villagers sing before, so this was kind of cool. All right. It was really fun. Thanks so much for the kind word, sugar cakes, both of you. Look at you go... Building a fan base. Soon you'll be opening up for KK on his world tour. <laughs> Guys, is there another balloon? Oh, 
my god, guys, there's another balloon. You know what's funny? The day that I had the um, Milk Mile challenge to uh, pop a balloon, do you know I could almost... It took me probably 15 minutes to actually find a balloon flying over the island. I mean, it was like... It was pretty much like almost the entire time I was playing. I kept running around, running back and forth, waiting at the beach, and I'm like, there's there's no balloon. And it was all because I had a... Um, I swear it was because we had a Nook Mile challenge. Oh, another 5,000 belts, guys. Ooh, getting rich just by popping the balloons. All right. Yeah, so what I'm talking about is the Nook Mile, the Nook Miles program. You go in the Nook Miles program and you click the plus sign. You get a hundred Nook Miles, um, not a hundred Nook Mile tickets, but a um, hundred Nook Mile points. So I'd get a hundred for um, hitting rocks. I have to hit five rocks, um, but it has a little times two. So when I do that, I would actually get. 200 points. We're not going to die for sea creatures. Um, I can earn bells by selling items. So I would get 150 times 2. I would get 300 bell, uh, 300 points, uh, Nook Mile points, for selling $5,000 worth, 5,000 bells worth of product. And then I would get 200 points for capturing a memory today. All right. Let's see. Ooh. Come on. All right. <laughs> Pietro, what's going on over here? It's dramatic, guys. There we go. That's not one of my best photos, that's for sure. But now you can see when we go back here, we go to claim. We have captured a memory today, so I get my Nook Mile tickets. So we're up to 45,000 Nook Mile tickets, which is actually really good, guys, because we're going to have to go villager hunting. And I'm probably going to want to take 10 Nook Mile tickets and see what kind of villager we can get. All right, guys. I gotta go inside. It's like raining and wet out here. All right, guys, let's get changed. And I am going to wear a groovy shirt. Let's do a heavy duty shirt today with, oh God, there's my casual pants right there. Do some corduroys. Do my orange hoodie. Do my orange glasses, guys. I don't know. A little bit much, I think. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, guys, I can't see. Hey, where are my regular glasses? Oh, there they are. All right, that works. All right, guys. Here I am. Well... 
Thanks a lot for stopping by Grand Union today. We got to see Dom's... Oh. Hey, settle down. We got to see um, Dom's birthday, and we got to say goodbye to Mary, and I picked up Daisy's photo, which I'll be putting up on the wall. Um, so, all in all, a fairly good day. Um, we'll be doing another villager hunt probably in the next episode, and I will continue to kind of decorate the island and show you guys what I've been up to. All right, guys, thanks for watching my video today. I always appreciate you stopping by Grand Union and taking the time to actually watch the video. Leave a comment below if you'd like, and uh, a thumbs up is always appreciated. And if you're just finding my videos for the first time and want to subscribe to my channel for future content, I would greatly appreciate it because I am a new YouTuber. So um, I guess that's it for now, guys. Thanks again for stopping by Grand Union, and we'll talk to you real soon. Bye, guys. Take care.